can we choose the profile the profiles that we want to use? Yeah, of course, if you already have all of that data in your IFC file, like for example, here you can see that we can check which uh, profiles we're using. You will see that we can reuse that data. And inside Struin Steel, we also have a wide variety of uh, elements and materials that we can use. So if you want to work with different steel grades, or if you want to work with different steel sections, that's something that we support by default. You can see that we can work either with raw steel or with built up sections, cold foam, tubular, you name it. And of course, you can always customize them to your liking. And you can even import and export all these libraries so you can reuse them later. Okay, so so you are saying that we can uh, create our own library, isn't it? Exactly. Okay, thank you. And of course, all the physical properties that we set up here for our section libraries, they will be used both for the detailing, but they will also will be used later if necessary for the design and the analysis of our joints. David, what about the codes? Can I choose the codes I want to use? Of course. By default, we come with many different building codes from around the world. So if you want to check your joints against building codes, like for example, the British standard, the American standard, the Euro code, mm -hmm. Brazilian or Indian standard, that's something that you can do by default with steel as well as even concrete. Ah, oh, great. And you can always customize the different coefficients that you're going to use for the final checks, including, of course, rotational stiffness. Mm 